All right, time for some new music. This is Vola, and the song is Paper Wolf. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. That's how new this band is to me. So let's just get straight into it and see what this is. I already feel like I'm in Europe. Vola looks like NOLA, New Orleans, Louisiana, but I don't think they have anything to do with that. I feel like I'm listening to a Beastie Boys song, but oh, moderately heavier. That's sarcasm for those that didn't pick it up. So we got some keyboards in there, some bass and guitar. Woman rolling something. I gather my strength from thoughts and prayers. The guitarist the singer. I empty my house to flee from chaos. Oh, she's she's creating a paper wolf. I dream of a king that won't betray us. Don't be late. Uh oh. Drinking Papa. Tis tisk. It's a light moment for the chorus. So I'm liking this so far. Find a dragon up in there. That's pretty cool. visuals that's who uh, has done some of the over culture stuff all right so first off i get you know kind of a, an abusive father it doesn't look super abusive because it seems like they uh you know pg rated the video which is cool you know you don't have to make everything completely brutal all the time 
but good song, like some good song structure, beautiful chorus, some great vocals. Um, I liked it overall. I'm definitely going to get a, get a subscribe and a, and a like to this band on this video. Check out more of their stuff. But yeah, just on that, on that topic, like, you know, whatever, if you're drinking around your kids, it's fine, but good God, the number of people that are just shit parents, you know, especially after becoming a parent and knowing so many parents, cause you know, they seem to be everywhere. Uh, Jeez, it doesn't take any freaking energy to be nice and just be patient. It, it, you know, it, literally being nice and being patient, especially with your own kids, is like it should be the easiest thing in the world. And I just, I got no tolerance for that. I got no tolerance for just moderately uh, abusive parents. You know, it, just verbal, whatever. It doesn't even have to be physical. Physical is a different different level of stuff that I'm just not even going to discuss right now. But just like him taking her mask. You know, what? what is she? It's, could be 13, could be 16. I don't know. It's, it's hard telling what age is. But seriously, it doesn't matter if she's 25 or 30. The father figure in someone's life should never go in and just destroy something that she had made. You should never do that to a child. I mean, the, the ramifications of that, just like the, the, the dream of the wolf coming to get the, you know, scaring him or whatever, that, it's so disturbing in the sense that that's always the happy ending. That's what we want to happen. But so often, like the, the abusers, whoever and whomever they may be, they don't get justice. They just raise kids that are then broken or have some, some damnable issue that they have to deal with for the rest of their life because they weren't built and given the strength that a parent should have gave them. And it's just, it's shameful. And, you know, in all seriousness, like if I'm speaking to one of those parents, you should be ashamed of yourself and you should feel bad. That's disgusting and so weak and pathetic to treat a child that way. But anyway, on that note, treat kids good, be kind to each other, be good to each other. We're all in this together. It, you know, we got we to gotta get through the day to day and we're all trying to make our lives better. Even, even those abusive parents, you know, gain forgiveness and do better. Just stop being that way. I know it's a hard ass sometimes, but we all got to do better. There's a lot of shit coming down the pipe in this world and we ain't going to do too well if we're all being grumpy, fussy butts. Anyway, with that, keep thrashing. Catch you next episode.